Hey guys, it's Mama J, and I bought a box from Dead Zone Collectibles. What did I get? Alright guys, so Dead Zone was on Whatnot the other night, and I happened to look, and he had some mystery boxes listed. Um, I want to say like $85.00 guaranteed value so I grabbed one now I know he opened it during the whatnot auction he asked me if he could and I told him yeah because I wanted everyone to see what kind of value was in the boxes hopefully to help him sell some more you know gotta help support other people but I'm gonna cut into this because honestly I don't remember everything that's in here sometimes we'll get stuff for Spectre's collection once in a blue moon we get stuff for mine but now that I have switched from collecting the glitter pops, we may not get as much for mine. Okay, there are four in here. Uh, he did throw me in some stickers, so I got the Dizzle collectible sticker, which will go in my book if I don't have this one. Um, all right, so there are four pops in here. So I'm going to pull them all out and show them off. They all feel like they're on pop protectors. I honestly, I mean, I'm sure once I see them, I'll remember, oh yeah, that was one of them, but hold on, I can't seem to get them out. Okay, so I got the first one out, and it is Evil Grounds Keeper Willie from the 2019 Fall Convention. Um, he did not put prices on here, so I'm going to go ahead and shoot them. So I can let you guys know what the prices are. Okay, so I'm going to pull up the Funko app and get a price on this. And then that way we can see where we landed. I know the box was over value. Oh, I just realized I went to the Funko app. And the Funko app does not distinguish between summer convention and actual convention stickers. Okay, so on um, Pop Price Guide, Hobby DB, he is, he's worth $45. <laughs> Who would have known? Not a keeper. If you're interested, let me know. Might still have him. Next one. I've kind of seen the top, and I know this isn't a collector for me. I got a whole mess of these at one point from Epic. Um, but I got, oh, I got Sailor Moon and Luna. So if you're looking for a Sailor Moon, let me know. Um, let me see how much she's worth. And Sailor Moon is $37. So what were we? $45, $37. I should probably write this down. Alright, next one. And again, this box was like $85. I must have two pops to go. Oh, this one? If I don't have it, it'll be a keeper. So there's this one from Ghost. Let's see how much he is worth. Oh, and it's got a Hot Topic sticker on it, but there is a tat showing. Oh, yes, just enough to pull it up. Uh, he is worth $23. Again, I'll have to check and see if I have him because I'm not sure if I do. Um, if I do, he's up for grabs. If I don't, then he's going in my collection. Last but not least, we got... Oh! Huh, this one I do remember because um, we actually have this pop. So if anybody is truly looking for this pop, reach out to us. Otherwise, we may keep it as an out-of-box pop. Um... But if somebody truly needs it for their collection, wants to pick it up from us, just let us know. There are four variants to this pop. This one is the limited convention one. Oh, there's a signed one. Oh, two signed one. That would be why there's so much variance. This one is a $50 pop. So, I paid $85 and I made... Like $155. Uh, I mean, come on. 
this is an amazing box from Dead Zone. Make sure you guys check him out. Give him a follow. And uh, snatch one of his mystery boxes. I've never been disappointed. But awesome, awesome box. Thank you, Dead Zone, for allowing me to pick up such an amazing mystery box. And everybody go give him a follow. Check him out. He releases mystery boxes every so often. And snatch yourself one. All right? Don't forget, stick around. Check out my Patreons. Smash that like button. Leave me a comment. Which pop did you like? Were you looking for any of these? Did you need to pick any of these up for your collection? Let me know. I'm interested. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, and hit the bell.